This is an iOmega CD ROM drive that you hook to your computer. And yeah, it's an antique. Uh, I thought I'd plug it in for you and power it up and at least give you a light show, but it won't even do that anymore. Um, yeah, so I mean, you can see it has a headphone jack and it had some display and a volume knob on it. Uh, this was also for digital input to your computer. Here's a couple indicator lights, the eject button. The plastic is so old, it's literally falling apart on me. Um, so this is the, uh, obviously this is the disc area, the laser. Uh, there's some foil back in here to ground this up here. So this is kind of a, I don't know, kind of a half way of, uh, of doing things. Um, okay, let's uh, look around it a little bit more. By the way, it's sitting on the power supply before I forget, so this big honking thing is the power supply for it. Um, it has two cables in the back, a USB, and then this really strange power plug. So, yeah, that's the power plug. Let's look a little bit more at the back. You see there's the, the USB, the power, and then uh, sound. And what's interesting is this, for some of you who may have never seen it, this is a micro, U uh, not USB, micro SCSI uh, port. And yeah, they used to have really big ones. These were really awkward, expensive to produce. Uh, but anyway, this is obviously an adapter that the company made you on here, but you could use a uh, direct SCSI connection, I guess. I'll leave that off. I'll take it, uh, turn it around and let you look at the rest of it. Here we can see what it says. It's just a CDRW, so this would do a read and write. And all the technical information it has the big class one laser warning and all that data on here. But you can hear that there's broken plastic falling around on the inside of it. A big chunk missing out here. Um, so yeah, it's no longer functional. But in the day, this was uh, how you had a CD-ROM attached to your computer. Well, I hope you found that useful and interesting, or interesting, maybe not useful in your uh, computer endeavors.